I have to tell you an incredible story. Yeah, okay, we're, which is, we're ready. No, you're not really ready. not ready. She'll take out the strong alcohol. <laughs> I always had this weird theory that I was somehow different from my family. I thought it was completely ridiculous. We've got two different fathers. You know, what on earth are you talking about? I thought my parents had come to Australia with my sister from Europe and I was this Australian implant into the family. I got an email from a woman who said, I think I'm your half-sister. Oh. Parents were Holocaust survivors from Poland. It was cold at that brigade. Everybody got the shovel and we started to dig our own grave. It was something that you cannot forget. I remember having a wonderful childhood and everyone believed we were the perfect nuclear family. Was mum happy in her marriage? No. If I put an eye on somebody, I could have that man. No challenge at all. I knew she had told me lies. There were secrets, and she was very secretive. Mum had a box of films, and I found footage of this man. He met Mum in 49 on a bus. In 49? Yes. You're going around digging. What for you have to go around digging? You grow up like Marta and Felix. That's it. You bring tourists on yourself. I had to find this man on the bus. He named streets after us. There's a whole suburb, Diane Churchill, which was my mum's niece that he married. There's Ronald, there's Dawson. How did he get to name all these streets? Because he was a surveyor. And there's Eve Court and Martha Court. I think he might be my father. And You're not joking! 99.98% <laughs> match with a stranger. He's an Australian from Tasmania. That's me. I've got goosebumps. I had no idea what to expect. You have arrived. That's it. I always grew up thinking I am a Jewish child of a Holocaust surviving father. We killed him with the axe and we ran out. And I'm so proud of him. Now I'm finding out a film my mother made would rewrite my entire life. Available now on Video On Demand.